Hi Leo, this is Wendy from Wendy's Tarot. Welcome to my channel. In this video, we're going to be spying on your person. I'm going to take a look at what does your person think about when they think about you. And also I'm going to see what is their view of you? How do they see you? What is their perspective of you? All right, let's go ahead and get started. Just as a reminder, this is a general reading. It might not resonate with everyone, but if it resonates with you, please give me a thumbs up. And subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. I'd really appreciate it. All right, let's see. Spirit angels and guides, please show me. What does this person think about when they think about Leo? I was about to say Gemini. Some of you might be dealing with a Gemini. All right, Leo, first card we have for you is the Eight of Pentacles, the Knight of Wands, the Eight of Swords in reverse, the Seven of Swords in reverse, the Judgment card in reverse, and the Eight of Cups. At the bottom, we have the Two of Swords in reverse. Okay. Hmm. They might see you as someone um, who's very busy with the Eight of Pentacles. Someone who is very focused on their work, on their money, on their own things. They may also see you as someone who is inconsistent here. Or they think of you as someone who, who is who goes back and forth they might they think that you are um, inconsistent they feel like you're not going to give them a second chance with the judgment in reverse they feel like you're walking away like you're slowly walking away you're slowly detaching from them They feel like you're all you're all about yourself now. You're more focused on yourself. All right, Leah, I'm going to take a look at your energy so I can differentiate or distinguish better these these energies between you and your person, okay? Let's see. Spirit angels and guys, show me the energy of Leo, please. How is Leo projecting their energy towards this person? What is what is their energy towards this person? We have the devil, okay, the tower, the world, the justice card in reverse, the seven of cups, and the king of wands in reverse, knight of cups at the bottom. All right, Leo, I feel like you're um, you're ending things with this person. You might feel like it's toxic. There might have been some sort of revelation here or some sort of truth that came up to the surface. It caused a dramatic ending or it caused a quick ending to happen. Um, something was unfair here with the Justice card in reverse. Someone might have been already engaged or in a commitment or married. There was a, an unexpected... Uh, Uh, reveal an unexpected reveal of some sort of secret for some of you something something became more clear okay there was 
there was clarity here and clarity was gained um and i feel with the seven of cups and the king of wands in reverse you're giving you're letting go of this person you're giving up on this person you're opening yourself up to other options hmm, okay why is the devil cards um here spirit show me about the devil Tell me about the devil. Ten of pentacles in reverse. A lack of stability. A lack of... Um, honesty. So someone might have already had a family. Or someone again might have already been married. What else about the devil? Six of cups in reverse. An ex might have gotten involved here between you and this person. Tell me about the tower. Judgment in reverse. And the eight of cups. Yeah, you, you walked away. Yeah, you rejected a second chance. Look at the same cards. Judgment in reverse and the eight of cups. You rejected um, this person um, in regards to having a second chance with this person. Hmm. Tell me about the world spirit. Page of Cups in reverse and the Knight of Pentacles. Mm. Leo, I do feel like you are cold with this person. You're being very cold with this person. Um, but, you know, maybe they deserved it. So, I don't know. It, it, it would seem so. Mm. Like It's almost like you're... you're you're choosing to even you're choosing to forget about this person. You're not acknowledging their existence anymore. <laughs> Why is the seven of cups here? Seven of wands in reverse and the sun card. Yeah, you're you're not gonna fight for this anymore. And the sun card, you're looking for new opportunities and new um, possibilities in love. Mm. Yeah, so this person definitely thinks of you as someone who is ignoring them. Um, yeah, someone who's ignoring them, putting up excuses to not see them. They think of you as maybe a player and someone who's walking away and refusing to have a second chance with them because of lies with the Seven of Swords in reverse, because of lies and deceit. What does this person want with Leo? Let's see. What are their intentions with Leo? What do they want with Leo? We have the Page of Cups. The Nine of Cups in reverse. There's a codependency. The Ten of Pentacles in reverse again. This person has some sort of codependency with you. Um, they want you back with the Page of Cups. They want you to. They want you to give them attention. They want you to give them love. Yeah, love and care, affection. They feel sad, they feel depressed, they're like a little child here. You might be dealing with someone young or someone who just acts childish. That might be why you're walking away from this person, you feel like they're childish. Yeah. What else, what do they want with Leo's spirit? Three of swords, they're heartbroken, the moon in reverse. Yeah, there was some sort of truth here that came up to the surface. Some sort of message here. I think someone gave the other person a message of of ending things. Sorry for the car outside. So I do feel um okay. Let me just wait for that to pass by. All right. Yeah, I feel like someone broke up with someone here. That's why they see you as the Eight of Cups. They see you as walking away and refusing to have a second chance with them. Hmm. 
Riley, I'm going to end the reading here. This was pretty um, chaotic, I feel. Let me see anything else. Anything else, Spirit? Seven of Cups. Seven of Wands in Reverse. Two of Pentacles. This person might have been cheating with the Seven of Cups here. It feels like there's a liar or a cheat or a cheater somewhere around here. Yeah. So they might have seen you as the one, as the person who was inconsistent or um, back and forth, but I think they were projecting themselves onto you. Yeah, they might have been projecting themselves onto you. But yeah, I do feel like that's the way they were seeing you. They were seeing you as someone who was uh, wishy-washy, inconsistent. But I, f I feel like there's a lot of, um, you know, uh, harshness here on both sides. There's there is a toxic energy for sure with the devil here. So overall I feel like in between you or between you and this person there's just a toxic connection overall. All right, Leo, I hope this resonated with you. I hope it helped you. Thank you so much for watching my video. Please give me a thumbs up and I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys, take care.